Sky Profit, baby. Back with another video. Hope you woke up this morning. I can't stress it enough. Hope you woke up this morning being grateful and appreciative. And what you have to be grateful and appreciative of is your sense of mind, your sense of being, your sense of self, your sense of love, understanding that you have these abilities that allows you to discern things, to discipline yourself, to focus. You have that willpower within you to help you accomplish, achieve, succeed, anything you want, anything you want. A lot of energies on this earth. We come from a lot of dark, negative energies. But we always had good energies. The story you know of Jesus. Ask yourself why that resonates with you. Simply because that's what you know would be the best thing for you to do. To walk with love and compassion, understanding, show individuals the right way. Have that peace of mind. To walk like that in this chaotic world. The seeds was planted. And now they, they've grown so much. We've grown so much within our consciousness because all our consciousness are connected. All our consciousness are connected. We've grown so much in consciousness to have a grasp on life. Life doesn't have to take us and spin us around, bring us through turmoil, confuse us, give us pain and heartache. It doesn't have to do that. We take control of that. We understand it on that deeper level. So the energy is shifting. We got all these new energies coming in. All these energies that's going to help us move forward, you know, progress. But you got to be mindful that these dark energies, negative energies, confused, hindrance energies are still out there. The darkness is going to try to hold on. That's why you don't have that complete sense of clarity because it's them old energies fighting within you. Don't want you to see the right way. Don't want you to see the light. Don't want you to understand that you can completely make that bad energy go away. You don't have to live within it. You don't have to think within it. You don't have to act within it. This is what's going on. It's old light codes, old light codes. Individuals had that was to keep us grounded. And when I say light codes, just to simply kind of explain it to you, a lot of the things that Jesus spoke of, were light codes. It's information that resonates with you, that activates your DNA. These old light codes has took us to the shift. You know, we made it to that shift of 
outweighing the hate with love. So we stepped in a new consciousness. So now we're receiving new light codes. That's what this whole awakening is about. You know, that's what this whole awakening is about. The new light codes for our new consciousness to activate more of our DNA so we can find more of ourselves. We can control more of our being, more of our aspects, more of our mental. By taking on these energies, you create your energy for yourself. Which intentions you direct it. Wherever it goes. But I want you to acknowledge. How significant. You are. On this earth. In these times. It don't matter if you at the bottom, feel like you at the bottom, trying to get to the top or at the top, trying to stay balanced. Now, when I say top and bottom, nothing to do with money, nothing to do with status. It's self. It's what you feel about yourself, how confident you are within yourself. That's low. Or that's high. Got to keep it high. You got steps to take. You got steps to teach. You got steps to go up. So. You the creator of your reality. Okay. Let me break something down for you right quick. To give you a better understanding about. This hell. You the creator of your reality. So it's only by you. Thinking in the ways, having the perceptions of lack, limitations, that negative energy. And you make yourself suffer. You put yourself through that suffering. What is suffering? If you experience it, it's living in hell. It's living in hell. So I need you to understand why you ever even heard it. I'm just breaking it down from a way deeper perspective than it was even given to you. Than it was even given to you. See, God don't make you suffer. God don't send you to hell. Without you finding your higher self, you're always going to suffer. You're always going to go through these heartaches and pains. Because you don't have that stillness about your thoughts, about your emotions. And about your being. Sense of self. Stop letting these low vibrational thoughts. And energies. Manipulate you. To feel a certain way. Manipulate you. To take on these. To put these limitations on yourself. Love, 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 love. Crazy love. Crazy love, man. Keep your vibration high. Don't think against the next man. Think with him. Think with him. Help him. Show him. Don't talk about him. You know, like. We come from these energies to where we, one of us will be truly than got hurt and we'll laugh about it. <laughs> you know, I told you, 
You know what I mean? Like love ain't even nowhere on the surface of that. You know, because we living within these dark energies. It's just all about that laugh, that good time, that 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 feeling, that wrong feeling, you know, but we were stuck in it. Don't regret your past. And every day you wake up, make an effort. Don't regret your past. Every day you wake up, make an effort. You got to learn how to stand firm and stay there within that moment. See, you got that moment right now. You in that moment right now. Right now, you in that moment. When I say sky prophet, peace out, it's up to you to keep yourself in the right mind frame to keep yourself in the correct state of being for yourself because it's like this it don't take but a second we've been living in this 3d we still in this 3d that's why it's easy for you to stay out of touch and tune with spirit with god with source with creator because we in the wilderness, man. We in the wilderness. Protect your energy. Protect yourself to and from. Watch your surroundings. Watch what you're taking years. Watch what you give out your mouth, man. Help somebody if you can. Give somebody some words of encouragement if you can. Words of encouragement, man. You the creator of your reality. Is heaven or is hell? Decide which one you want your reality to be. Discipline yourself, man, and take the proper steps to get to that place. And it can only be heaven. Till next time, man. Love everybody, man. Sky Prophet. Peace out.